13 volunteers hosted the Eastern Kentucky Colonials at Good Friend Tennis Center, where the Vols topped the Colonials by a score of 6-1. The Vols, led by six-year head coach Sam Winterbotham, held a 5-0 record in season openers going into the day. However, the Vols lost to Memphis early in the day and looked to get back on the right track against Eastern Kentucky. The Vols got off to an early lead as they took the doubles point despite debuting three freshman starters. The Vols number 33 ranked doubles team, featuring Miklas Lebedis and Hunter Reese, headed the Vols taking their doubles match in an 8-6 win. The two other Tennessee's double teams, made up of Knoxville native Branham Fickey, paired with Edward Jones and Jared Chaplin alongside Trim Nagelstad, also won their doubles matches handily. With a 1-0 lead going into singles, the Vols looked to capitalize on their momentum. Tennessee's first singles point came from Court 5, where junior Taylor Patrick defeated Eastern Kentucky's Jay O'Mayo in two sets by scores of 6-1, 6-1. Soon to follow was Fickey on Court 2, who added to the Vols' lead, earning the team their second singles point. Tennessee's three-slot Reese was the only Vol to drop his match, losing his singles point in three sets by scores of 4-6, 2-6, and 0-1. Got two victories quick, and uh, I had a chance to get that last one to clinch and didn't get it and kept going, lost, lost a set, went to the third and ended up losing that and that wasn't great. We didn't, there against EKU I think we fixed, we fixed a lot of things, a lot of, we came out, we got the job done and, uh, and that's, you know, we're young and we're working on it and we're going to get it. Adding to Tennessee's unease, the Vols number one Lebedis found himself tied one set to one set versus Eastern Kentucky's Nikolaus Schroeder. Going into the third and final set, the Vols number one needed medical attention due to cramping and tightness in his shoulder. Following the brief injury pause, Lebedis won the third set, winning the match by a final of 6-3, 5-7, earning the Vols their fourth singles point. The Vols went on to etch Eastern Kentucky by a final of 6-1, giving the Vols their first win of the season.